can't go to sleep on that Lamar fast break. Mike Oliver's record set 30 years ago is gone by the board. Oh. Did he make the one in the kiss? Yes, Touchdown Cardinals! That's Marcus Jackson! Marcus Jackson. season of the game he got hurt and, you know but you have to be prepared you got to have depth at that position and, and last year we had Cody Hussey uh, who didn't end up playing much ended up having some other things he had to do but Mike Vincent Caleb Harmon really stepped up just with the extra reps they got and uh you know Mike Vincent went from you know four string running back to starting running back we had Octavius Logan last year too who had some knee problems you know, so running backs are expected to get banged up, and you know, next guy has to step up and make plays. So, yeah, we have a, a lot better. We've made a conscious effort to go out and get running backs. Uh, you know, teams in this conference, you have to be able to run the ball to get first downs and things like that. Uh, so, yeah, we made a big effort to go out and get running backs, and we have a good crew. Got some good freshmen. The whole freshman class is good, but Darrell Harris is an exceptional athlete. You know, a true freshman coming in, making people miss, understanding the game, understanding the blocking schemes. And uh, just understanding football, having the knowledge of football, is pretty good for a freshman with Darrell. Uh, of course, Herschel Walker comes from Oklahoma State. Sims. Who did I say? Herschel Walker. <laughs> yeah, he reminds me of Herschel Walker. <laughs> Herschel Sims. Just a, just, just a great running back, man. The kid squats over 600 pounds, bench presses over 400 pounds, so he's just a strong running back, understands the game, a good blocker in the passing game, can catch the ball, he's a good route runner. He's an all-around back, and uh, you know, kind of what the, the prototype of, of what you want in a running back. Uh, runs with power, and a smart kid, so he'll be good for us. He'll be good for us. He kind of, you know, if the old line makes mistakes, he's the type of running back that can overcome those things. So, well, I mean, we're still young at running back. With Daryl Harris is a freshman, and uh, Herschel's a freshman. DePodrick is a senior coming back, and he does provide some leadership there. But. Uh, even though with Masakowski with our quarterbacks, they're they're young in this offense as is everybody, but they're junior college players, so they're actually juniors. And he went to the University of Kentucky, got their D1 experience, so you know he's you can't consider Masakowski a, a freshman. You know, right? He, he's a he's a good quarterback. Um, with injuries and youth in our O line, yeah, it's it's good to have a guy like DePaulic back there that's older to teach these guys. I heard him tell Darrell Harris the other day, you know, don't wait to get yours. You know, get yours not right now. Don't don't try to red shirt. Get out there on the field. And I'm listening, I'm like, well, that's your position you're competing with. So, you know, he's just a good guy. You know, really a team player and that type of senior leadership is good. Yeah, they, they've taken to each other. I mean, Herschel came in with a, with a different work ethic, you know, obviously coming from Oklahoma State. And, you know, our guys have gravitated to that. Made the Padres start working better in the weight room. Uh, Darrell coming in as a freshman, he sees those guys, so he jumps in and works us out. Caleb Harm has always been a beast in the weight room, and he'll probably play a fullback position for us. Uh, hybrid, he can play some tight end also. So, you know, we're a lot better at running back and I think the team would be better for it.